I love you. I love you, Dad. Lots of love in here. Lots of love. Is this the way <laughs> restaurants act? <laughs> Mill City may have the words barbecue and brew in their name, but what they really specialize in is love. Owner Renee Walterding is the mastermind behind the restaurant where she serves pork with a side of personality. I got this big giant personality. We did it! <laughs> Not only do everybody know me, if they didn't know me, they know me now. Oh, you got funny jokes. Because I'm here every day and I greet everybody. Did someone take y'all's order? It's not a customer that don't leave here, that I don't go up to that table and make sure everything is right. And if it's not, I make it right. I've always been a big people pleaser, but at this point, I don't want to just please people with my personality. I want to please people with my food. When she opened up her family-friendly barbecue restaurant in Lowell, Massachusetts, she decided to bring her family along for the ride. I work here with my family. Mill City, man. All the way. My son is executive chef, and then I have my sister, Becca Brown. Hey, Miss Cornbread. The thing about Becca is she's been cooking her whole life. Everything she cooks, she grew up making, and she loves. And then I have my sister, Rita. I'm and then I have my niece and me that are bartenders. And then I have my cousin, his name is Jamal Hardin. Jamal's role is the barbecue guy. The longer you smoke it, the better the meat fall off the bone. That's why I like to see the meat fall off the bone. Once you pick it up off the ground and falls off the bone, you're good. Even in the winter, he's out there on the barbecue grill. Jamal's out there when it's a blizzard, snow rain. He doesn't care. He just loves to grow. Since I can remember, every holiday, every weekend, you just go to Jamal's house. He's barbecuing. I'm in a whole different world. Nobody's bothering me. I don't hear nothing. She let me barbecue out here all day. I'd barbecue out here all day. You ask anybody about Jamal Hart, and they'll tell you, oh, he's the barbecue guy. And all of that barbecue is good to the last bite. Whether you order their sensational smoked turkey, flavor-packed pulled pork, perfectly cooked brisket, or ribs that drive the customers wild. They rave over the ribs here. When they bite into our ribs, they're like, oh, they're so good, they're good, they're good, they're good. Oh, they're so tender and juicy, oh. And if you aren't up for a whole rack, just order the rib tips. It's a smaller version of ribs, bite size, that we cut right off the bone. We flour them and deep fry them. And then we put a sauce on it. Carolina Gold is what we put on the red tips. It's crunchy, it's tasty, you can taste the smoke in them. They're to die for. Other inventive appetizers include the overstuffed pulled pork quesadilla, crispy fried pickle chips, and decadent mac and cheese balls. Mac and cheese balls are a mac and cheese balled up, dipped in egg, rolled in cheddar cheese, and rolled in breadcrumbs. They are so creamy and hot and crispy. Oh. Mm, you just gotta taste them. But a barbecue restaurant is only as good as its sides, and that's Becca's territory. Oh, I love to cook. Cooking is my thing. Oh, yeah, that's my thing. I love to cook, especially Southern food, because you gotta add love, because if you don't add love to Southern food, it's just Southern food. You'll usually find her back in the kitchen making her famous collard greens, sensational barbecue baked beans, creamy coleslaw, and corn on the cob. But the side that everyone should try is her incredible cornbread. If you close your eyes, you wouldn't even think you was eating cornbread. You thought you was eating a piece of cake. All you needed was frosting. And when she's not making sides, she's frying chicken. The thing I like about her chicken is she soaks it in buttermilk, and then she seasons it, and then she deep fries it. It's just like getting it at grandma's house. When you bite into this fried chicken, it is juicy and it is hot. You just like, oh, you just can't get enough of it. Wait till you taste it. You gotta taste it, chicken. And if there's room left after all that comfort food, dessert is a must. With options like classic banana pudding and a tasty strawberry shortcake. We make the cake and we use fresh strawberries and fresh whipped cream. It's awesome. It's really good. But no dessert can top the sweet feeling you have when you leave Mill City Barbecue and Brew. It's like, you know, you're sitting at like a, a family's house. And that's how we are. You know, we're one big happy family. We know how to knock each other down and pick each other up. We know how to scream and yell and kiss and love. You know, so yeah, it is good working with them.